Jason, it's Deep Patel, founder of GoGreenSolar.com, the company helping you get started with green energy. Today I want to talk about a product that's going to solve a huge problem our society faces today. It's called the Grid Tide Solar LED Streetlight. It's not your ordinary streetlight, it's a power plant. According to the U.S. Department of Energy, 22% of the electricity used in the U.S. powers lighting. A majority of that energy used is going to street lighting. And that's because our streets are still lit up with inefficient incandescent light bulbs. What if I told you we have the technology here today to turn every street light into a contributor to society? Turn those liabilities into assets for your city net zero every street light in America. Our product could be retrofitted onto any street light and will significantly reduce America's carbon footprint. How much of an impact would that make? The great part about our product is it's really simple to understand. It's not rocket science. The solar panels attached to the side of each street light pole produce 700 watt hours during the day. That electricity is fed back into the grid when your city needs it the most. At night, the 60 watt LED street lights only consume 600 watt hours. This is a vast improvement from old incandescent lighting technology, which is notorious for wasting energy. The LED street lights put the same light output for a fraction of the electricity usage. Combining solar panels with LED lights can turn every street light in America into a mini power plant. Let's do the math. So the solar panels produce 700 watt hours during the day and the LED lights at night only consume 600 watt hours. So that's an extra 100 watt hours going into the grid on a daily basis. This is going to solve a huge problem in our society because it's going to turn all that dead space into revenue producing assets for your city. I need your help because I need to get this product in front of every city official so we can move forward to a sustainable energy future.